y'all welcome back to my channel it's your girl marie and y'all already know i'm bringing to you back by the title of this video i am about to start doing these entrepreneur website series however you want to call it um so i'm not gonna keep talking let's sit back chit chat and start that business that you always wanted to start before we get into this video i need you to go ahead and hit that subscribe button turn the post notification bell on so you never miss an episode also Comment in the comment box down below if you are thinking about starting a business. If so, what are your general ideas of like what you want to start? So without further ado, let's get into this video. Your girl started a business. Yes. Um, before I even get into the specs of my business, let's talk about why. I wanted to start a business because I've never been the type of person to work for somebody else. Um, I've always had leadership skills, um, my own way of thinking, and me doing a nine to five, it just don't ever work. Like I be, I get fired, I cuss folks out. You know, it just don't, it just don't mix. So instead of me sitting around saying, you know, I can't get a job or I don't want a job, I was like, let's be proactive. Let's figure out what it is that you can do. Long story short, um, I have a legacy business in my family and it's being passed down to me, and I am running it. So technically, I don't work for anybody. I work for myself. But of course, you know, corporate life, you still have somebody to report to. Um, but it's more freedom and that's what really opened my mind into starting my own business like what is it that I'm good at what is it that I like to do what is it that will be fun and exciting for me to do and it does not feel like I'm going to work every day so of course you guys already know your girl has been doing YouTube for going on a year now on this channel um, I have a couple channels as well we've been doing that on and off about two years and everybody has always asked me Marie, where you get them lashes from? Marie, will your lashes fit your face? Marie, you don't like you finna fly away. You know, type shit. So I was like, hmm. And it was crazy because I was always a plug for lashes, but it was to send people somewhere else. Stupid, right? I'm letting people use me and my platform to send them traffic. So your girl put a business head on and said, X out the middle man. X out the middle man. People already come to you because they love you and they love your personality. People already see, you know, I can always wear my lashes so they'll see how my styles look. Promote yourself. Yo. So here's where we are now. I decided to start my business. I think I officially started it and like really wanted to get serious and really stay at it. February is, is when it was a thought. Um, and it was a thought, you know, I always think about great ideas. I always have million dollar plans. And then when I figure out the work and the stuff that goes into it, it's like, eh, nope, tried it. But I don't know, with my lashes, it just came so effortless. Like, it, everything came to me. And that was like the most easiest thing ever. I'm scrolling on Instagram and somebody's like, hey, looking for a vendor? Vendor, vendor for what? And what does it say? Lashes and hair. Happy dog. So I started really doing research, I'm checking out other pages, figuring out, you know, putting stuff down on paper. What's my name gonna be? Why is that gonna be my name? You know, what's my colors? All of that good stuff. So once I started putting it on paper and really like um, manifesting it is when it really created itself, honestly. like. I looked up and I had done made a website. I had done made a name. I done had flyers. I done had business cards come to the house to see how I like these colors together. I had done, and everybody around me is like, oh, dang, you really were serious about selling lashes. I don't know if I told you that, but I'm, I'm selling lashes. So I was like, yeah, I mean, everybody always asking me about them. Why not? So I would run business ideas through my mom because she, of course, has ran her business, started her business from ground zero, and has been doing it for 20 plus years. So she is my business mentor and money manager because I've been needed sometimes and running ideas from her and you know trying to figure out how much I would sell my lashes for in order to get a revenue back and you know doing all the back end stuff that nobody ever sees and I came up with a name I was laying in my bed one night and talking to my boyfriend and we came up with Winks and I was like eh it was cute Winks you know, winks. Your eyes, you wink. But then I was like, eh, it really wasn't telling me what it is. Because with your business name, it has to be like, ooh. And then, okay, I know what she's selling. So winks really wasn't feeling, I really wasn't feeling it. And I would keep telling myself, I had done made like little logos. 
and everything and it just was like you know what i'm gonna show y'all how my logo started and it just was like mm -mm, not feeling it so then i came up with wink with minx see that you wink with your eye their lashes wink with minx crazy how i came up with that and i just started saying it saying it saying it saying it saying it. i'm like doing my regular day-to-day -day stuff and wink with me 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 like couldn't tell me nothing and then i'm doing something that has nothing to do with this business and my slogan just comes to me god said girl do it and my slogan is wink with me so your beauty can be in sync oh don't they just roll out the tongue? Don't it make you want to cop some meat? Like, y'all, I was just in love. Like, it it told you what my business was about. It told you what I'm selling. And it just, it, it draws you in. And I want to be in sync. I know, girl, cop you some lashes. So, it's just dope. And then, like, all my little flyers is share, share with us so that we can see that your beauty is in sync. And then hashtag my beauty is in sync. So everything just was in sync. <laughs> you feel me? So it was just perfect. Um, and then of course the legwork came in and trying to find vendors and stuff like that. Um, but after I came up with a name, it was the colors. And the colors that I did decide to go with are silver, teal, and I may have to use black and white here and there just to give it that underlying tone so you can read the the font and the words. Um, so, but my main colors are teal and silver. So the reason I chose teal because even though throughout this whole business, like I said, everything just came to me fluently. It came to me bright as day and it was what it was. And believe it or not, teal means clear communication and clarity. Okay. So that just was like, boom, this is where it's supposed to be. And then I chose silver because it means sophisticated and elegant. And of course, you know, to see stuff in silver, you, a lot of women don't really grow to love silver until they're older and they know like the ins and outs of silver. It lasts longer. It looks better on melatonin skin. You know, it, it's a lot of stuff that goes into silver. That's why you see a lot of older women wear silver. So to put you up on some game, silver is where you finna be in the next five, 10 years. So those colors just, it popped to me. It was beautiful. Now my logo looks like this with my colors included and with Winx with Mix. So everything just came to me. It was just a great, great idea. Um, um, My go-to thing on my website is lashes. However, I figured, you know, you can't have lashes and not sell lip gloss because everybody loves lip gloss and I wanted to make mine more of a grown lip gloss. So it's not that, that girly, kiddish kind of thing. It's more of a like a, I'm finna go be freak nasty with my man type shit. You know, like, just you don't want to put on lipstick, but you want that little tint. So I decided to make lip gloss as well. Everything is handmade, y'all. Um, I did a lot of research on that. What's good on your lips? Because you don't want to make something and sell it and it got people's lips falling off. Like, y'all, that is the worst way to do business. The worst way to mess up your brand before it even gets out there. You know, it is just, don't do it. Like, don't do it. Um, and before I even wanted to say anything about selling lip gloss, I wanted to make sure that my friends tried it out. I want to make sure I can wear it and it's actually like something I would wear. Um, and even with my lashes, like I found a great phenomenal vendor. And before I even said this is going to be part of my inventory, I was always buying lashes from this vendor. Like, I want to try this style. I want to try this. I want to try that. And even though there are lashes in my line that I may not wear, I have to think of other people. Somebody might like it. You may like it. You know, it all depends on your style of lash and what you like. Um, but I know for me, for the most part, I know a lot of people are always complimenting me on my lashes. So I wanted to do a more of a, a more of a me kind of style. Um, and that way I'll always be able to wear them. I mean, I will put on the other lashes just to showcase them. But I promise you, they probably won't be on for a little longer than today. Because I don't know, certain lashes I just can't do. My face is already big. I already, with my hair colors, it just, the last thing I want is my lashes to look like a tarantula. Okay? So... That being said, um, how I will be selling everything is on my website. If you would like to buy anything or support your girl, it'll be in the description box down below. Shop Winks with Minks.com. And um, we do ship internationally. I don't know just yet. 
Um, I have to look into the cost and if I even have any buyers that far. Um, but for the most part, it's the United States in those areas. I ship. I also can meet you. No, I'm lying. No, I won't. I ship. Um, and yeah, so this pretty much wraps up this video. Uh, I just wanted to come on here and the first episode is just introducing my business, what it is, how I'm doing it, how you guys can shop and show your support. Um, for my next episode though, if you guys would like to see my inventory and or how I may organize and keep everything together, like my little office space, I can do that as well. If you guys have any questions on how to start a business, Comment in the comment box down below and let me know and I will answer them as soon as possible. Also, you guys can email me and follow me on Instagram. We can talk there. And you guys, please, please, please follow my Wings with Meeks Instagram. I'll have all of this linked in the description down below. I love you guys and I hope this inspires you to start that business you've always been thinking about. Peace.